Rightio, time for another video. Let's get the ziggy fired up. I'm going to preheat it. And I'll show you guys what I'm going to cook in a minute. All burners on hot. All burners on. Let's see what we're going to cook up tonight. Right, so we're going to cook up some slow cooked lamb shanks with tomato, red wine, and rosemary. And it was a special. Fourteen eighty one for just under a kilo. It's mainly bone there, but we'll see how we go. Oh, so here we go. The lamb shanks are still fairly frozen. There is a lot of sauce in that, and there's a lot of oil in the tray. I gave a little bit of a flame up prior to the video. We're going to leave that and then flip it, then flip it, and then when they're loose, so we go. Yum yum. Yeah, so the lamb shanks are sizzling away nice, low and slow, just bubbling away in their own juices and oils. Indirect heat. On high. <clears throat> On the burners. Yep. And a nice marinade. So we're going to get these a quick flip with a spatula. Give them just a bit of a flip. Get that juice to marinate all the way around the shanks. Most people say, why don't you use a spatula? Well, I cleared the spatula before. And I think I lost it inside somewhere. And I really can't be stuffed going inside and get it. Make these nice and saucy, and we'll give it a rotation. So it's indirect heat, but I am using the uh, I can't remember what it's called. Using that that other part, <laughs> the other part that I use to cook the uh, pizzas in the pots and pans on. Will come back to me sometime soon, but um, yeah, come up quite nicely. But as we usually do. Let's get the cooking spray out. Extra virgin olive oil spray. Ziggy's favourite recipe. Let's give it a flame up. Ooh, look at that. Yum yum. We'll give one final burst when they're when they're about to come off, but looking good so far. Yeah, so this is the ending result of the lamb shanks. So they've been resting for probably about 20 minutes now, so I've cut the heat right off. It's all a bit of nice juice there, actually. Don't even need the spatula. So, as you can see, they are cooked beautifully. <laughs> it's still very hot. So as I said before, you cannot be stuffed by the spatula, so get the old trusty tongs out. Only on the bone, not on the meat. Shit, there's a lot of juice there. I think someone just flicked up below the phone. A lot of juice with a lot of oil. But, if you can see, this looks pretty much perfect. And look at that. That is just very soft, tender meat. You see that's just. Yeah. So browns are pink, the way you want lamb. You don't want lamb fully white. Fully white, that means it's overcooked. But this is just tender. Look at that. Just soft. Beautiful. So, anyway, guys, I'm going to let these just sort of simmer in the heat and, well, residue heat and the sauces. And I'll show you the next video. Peace.